Hi, this is Tamal and in this quick video, I will show you how to resize images for your blog. So first of all, you need to download this free software called Photoscape from photoscape.org. I highly recommend it. So first of all, you just click on Photoscape to open it. And now click on editor. And now I'm going to need the images image to be resized. So let me just open a sample image. So this is a sample image and uh, it's on 1600 to 1200 dimension. And to use it on my blog, I want to just shorten it. So let me just put it on Photoscape. And to resize the image, you just click on resize from home tab and now you can just resize it so for my blog I'm just using 500 pixels in width and you can see the height will adjust automatically okay so you can now see that the image has been resized and it's now smaller so all you have to do now is to just click on save and it will click it will just save on now if I minimize it, you can see that the new image is right here and it's much smaller. But amazing fact is that the original image that you have resized is already there. So if you ever need to have that old image back with that size, you can just have it. And that's that's that was for the one image single image but what if you want to uh, convert images in bulk for an example in this uh, folder I have a couple of images and I want to convert all of them as you can see each of these images are in higher dimension and I want to re reduce them as well so to do this just go to your photoscape and click on batch editor on the batch editor uh, you just have to put all of those images over here and now you can just adjust all of those images at once so for now I'm just adjusting the width as 500 pixels and you can see the height will adjust automatically and it will apply the same for apply as the same for all images now finally you have to click on convert all and then you just have to just click on save it will start converting and it will finally show you conversion complete and now if I just go to the document and the folder you can see there's a new folder inside it it's called upload output and you can see that all these images are now converted into smaller sizes at once so that's it for this tutorial and I hope you have enjoyed it and please leave a comment thank you hey if you are looking for more videos courses and training on this matter Please click on the link below this video to check out my other stuff. Thank you.